Hi there everyone, Carrie Magger here with The Yoga Farm. Today we are going to talk dancer. I have the lovely Miss Gina with us again tonight. So this was requested by Miss Ashley Moon and this is one of her new favorite poses. Um, I don't know if it's a new favorite pose, but I know it's one of her favorite poses. So we're going to talk a few things about it. It is um, a more challenging pose because it is a balance pose. Uh, so we want to talk about a few things um, about dancer as we go into it. So we want to find our Tadasana. If you want to go ahead and face sideways for us. So in Tadasana, you're nice and grounded. We're going to bring our hand to the back ankle. So bringing the, the right ankle up, grab hold of the back ankle. You can use a chair just as Gina is doing here to help balance yourself as you're learning dancer, um, just to kind of keep yourself in check. So what we want to make sure is when we rise up that our hips stay level. We don't want to rotate one side, sorry. <laughs> That's why she's holding the chair. We don't want to rotate one side over and up when we come up. We want to keep it nice and down and level and let our, our, our opening be here in the front of the hip crease. So we're going to slowly um, lean just a little forward and then try to push your ankle into your hand, which is going to rise, see if this knee rise up, the more strength you have, the more it's going to rise, rotate that hip back down, there you go. And the more you can lean forward, the more you will, and then you'll reach out with a hand if you start to gain some confidence. Beautiful, beautiful. And then you're gonna rise back up. And I'll have you do the other side. Now one thing while she's taking a moment to adjust herself, I wanna make sure that you're doing several back bends before you start this. Um, do some camels, um, uh, uh, sorry, cobra or sphinx. Anything that's a back bend bridge to open up your back because you are doing a little bit of a back bend in this as you're opening up because this will eventually lead to King Cobra where you are leaning all the way back with both hands. So we want to bring that hip down just a little. There you go. So we want to focus on that as well. Excellent. Rise back up. Now, if you cannot reach your ankle, have no fear. Grab you a strap. You can place the strap around your ankle and then pull it behind you and do the same thing behind you. If you have questions or if there is a tip you would like, please share it with us. We'd love to hear from you. Thank you again to Ashley for the suggestion tonight and we will see you guys next week.